And next up. All right, Jeff, don't hit me. That's don't it, hit me, Jeff. Team, give it to God. Caroline's gonna love this. All right, pull. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Woo! The man on a mission. Give it to God. BBQ. Keith, what are we doing? All right, we're going to shoot some sporting clays today, not to be confused with skeet or trap. It's sporting clays. Yeah, what's it? We'll be in the woods. There'll be kind of dual targets. You'll have to shoot one as soon as you pull the trigger on the first one. The second one's going to come out, so you have to shoot it as well. You're so, kidding me. No, we're going to have a hundred. That's more difficult. We're going to have a hundred shots. So you have a hundred chances to hit one. <laughs> So, well, the I thing, got faith in you though. Now listen, listen, one of the things that's important to me uh, is just a deal. If you hunt and you and you kill it, you got to grill it. That's correct. And, and so, you you, you got to so, grill it and you got to wrap it in bacon or yeah. it's a sin. Well, we, exactly. Understand? Exactly. So we're, we're going to be working on the recipes. For, yeah. We're for looking we for, we're looking for. Uh, That'll be either tonight or tomorrow. Well, yeah. Tomorrow, tomorrow we'll do, we'll throw those in with the but rest of the class. But we are looking for suggestions for time and temp on these things. Yeah. So exactly. any, any help's appreciated. Right. I think, I think getting them through the stall to the, to where they break in the tender yes. is going to be interesting to see where that happens. Yeah. We know where it happens on brisket, but the right. sporting clays we haven't, we haven't We're going to have a tough time yeah. with the connection. Of tissues and these things. Oh, brisket's looking good. Oh, oh 170 in brisket. Oh. Okay, here we go. The Cinderella story. That's a 0 for one. That's a 0 for one. Okay, we have a technical issue we have to resolve. They they didn't tell me that it had to be in the air when you shot it because I got one on the ground out there. Fire, fire. Ladies and gentlemen. I'm always one short. Hey, that's what she said. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, she is a uh, or uh, Bobby is a. Uh, this could be a 180 right here. This could be a 180. Brisket's on the, on the hub. Oh, and he missed it. Oh, you just missed a 180. Bobby, that was almost a 180. How do you feel about that? I am wore out. It was a lot of work. Yeah. Uh, Why'd but, you miss it? You had it right in your vision right there. Well, you know, sometimes the uh, shells just don't go where you want them to go. <clears throat> okay, we're on uh, we're on like the ninth station at 72 shots in, just like any other athlete. I'm not gonna let anybody. Oh, I can't feel my shoulder anymore. I can't let these guys know this competition. So. Okay, Bobby, what do you think so far? Um, I think the skeet are winning. I'm just glad they're not shooting back. Have you have you given any thought or consideration as to how we want to um, cook these up? Well, I think it's going to uh, require low and slow because they're going to need a lot of tenderization. Yeah, I, I agree. Uh, but I think, uh, you know, some cheese, jalapeno wrapped in bacon, I think that's the way to go. I think so. And listen, I'm tell you what, as many as we shot and as many as we've put down under the, just the concussion of the, the round going by it and missing it, I think we're all, if anybody goes away hungry, it's their own fault. Yeah, because... Uh, yeah, they have been tenderized. Even the ones that we didn't hit, they, they right. got scared awfully bad. Exactly. The legend, Forrest Dillmore, Forrest Fine Foods, the legend. The only living legend I know. You can race that, Jeff. Some jambalaya, rice jambalaya kind of stuff. Some collard beans. <laughs> oh. Look at that. 
Okay, we're uh, we're barbecuing probably 150 pounds of, of meat, and uh, what are we having for lunch? I'm sorry, I wasn't giving that that request. I would gladly. Rayford, what are we having for lunch? We'll have a pizza. Yeah. At this uh, without spray, barbecue without. class, we're having a great time. We're moving forward. So here we are at a barbecue class, but we're eating pizza. How much? How much? How much meat are we cooking right now? We're cooking uh, hundreds of pounds. 150 pounds or something, or 200 pounds? Or? Uh, I would say, yeah, at least. And that's what we're eating is pizza. That's barbecue. It's a blue again. Something tells me it's another day gone wrong. Something tells me it's the same old sad songs, but I get a feeling there's a watch this. It's a blue I can't describe